Hey everybody and welcome to Bastion or Bastion or whatever it's called. Uh, I just came out on Steam I think today or yesterday or something. And actually we've been waiting for this game for a long time so I'm glad it's finally out and um, I played the demo before and I love it so let's just start a new game. Proper store is supposed to start at the beginning. Ain't so simple with this one. Now here's a kid whose whole world got all twisted, leaving him stranded on a rock in the sky. He gets up, sets off for the bastion, where everyone agreed to go in case of trouble. So here we are in the world of Bastion. And what I love about this game is that the narrator is actually always saying something uh, that fits to the situation you're in. Oh, he's also commenting your moves and everything, so that's pretty nice. The ground actually. forms up under his feet as it point the way. He don't stop to wonder why. It's kind of like um, finds his lifelong friend just lying in the road. It's kind of like a dynamic well, it's a narration. Reunion. Narration, narratory. I don't even know. Uh, uh, dynamic comment, uh, commentating. He sees what's left of the rippling walls. Years of work undone in an instant. In the calamity. I bet there are a lot of uh, hidden things that I <laughs> don't know about yet, but that's okay. That a survivor? No, ma'am. It's a gas fella. Forced out from under. Gas ground. fella. Kid pops him good. Starts to feel his bruises though. Yeah, so we get our things unlocked one by one, so now we actually see our health and experience points. But Kid we don't just see our me. other stuff yet. <laughs> just reaching around. Yeah, especially with those uh, dynamic blocks here, I bet there are a lot of hidden areas. Can almost make everything. <laughs> I don't know what those the repeater falls out of the sky. Crystals are for you. The gods, but it'll have to do. I like to think. Gotta hold her still to spin up the chamber. If I can shoot something over there now that I have the thing, but I don't see anything useful, so I'm not sure. It's probably not. Well, there's probably nothing hidden yet. Since it's the tutorial, but who knows? Just love collecting stuff, so I try to smash a lot of things. Kids worked up quite a thirst by now, so that fountain looks real inviting. Yes, it does. Sometimes you just need a drink. So now we have health potions here in the hut. Can you send with F? School squirts tunnels up around. Oh, I don't like those. Must have fled here from the mines. I kind of feel like I'm pretty bad at fighting sometimes, but so far I survived. Kid finds a memento from a girl he knew. Always used to fancy her. I think those are quest items or something. I'm not sure. But, um, okay, the last time I went directly into the saloon, but I saw it's that there is a... the old saloon still standing. Used to have the nicest view. There's a way down here, so let's see what's here. Uh, just a bunch of shards. I don't know what those are. Let's we'll find out soon. So let's get in here. He sets foot inside one of Selandia's famous watering holes. Inside's old Rondi, the bartender. The calamity got him for his drinking did. And this is gonna be our first uh, bigger fight. I don't know. It's then gonna, gonna be a lot of enemies. Shield. It's gonna clean up things here. But just as he's getting a handle on it. The security takes him for a petty thief. This kind of Zelda like you can just 
lock those balls off and he would hurt himself. But they're not always directly hitting him, so... Oh, well, there he goes. Special delivery. Okay, yes. so no, it's not. We should destroy those as soon as possible, because they will actually Windbags spawn mobs. Up the last call. Oh, careful. They can actually stun them by holding a shield up. Oh, it <laughs> <More squirts, laughs> kind of worked better than the first time. I really don't like those because I, I can't seem to. A big um, old fella pops out. Guess I have to kid. roll a bit more. Oh wow! A lot of. The fuck that name. Kid sees there the way to the bastion out the window. It's a bit of a drop. Hello. Ronnie always wanted his ashes scattered here. <laughs> oh, no, he did. Okay, let's go. Get some more shots or whatever. He gets a good look at things on his way down. He lands on top of a breaker's bow, and it ain't broke. A new weapon! A bow! I kinda like it, I kinda don't like it, I'm not sure. Because this one you can actually charge, but you can't quick fire. Uh, Kid spies a good purchase of yeah. target practice. He not sure if I like it. The string all the way back. Right back at you. Oh, I was gonna see a bit. And I love this one. long before the kid could loose an arrow, strong and true. So, yeah, the game is 15 bucks. The kid pockets a memento from a breaker, once the fastest man in the land. 15 bucks on Steam, so that's pretty good. And you can actually get the soundtrack version as well. So, uh, I think it's 5 bucks more, so. I mean, the soundtrack is really like, good. I enjoy it a lot, so it's probably worth it getting it. Good news is the emergency defenses still work. Bad news is they aim it for the kid. Ah. Kinda, I kind of have to wait a second or something before I um, before I equip the shield after aiming, otherwise it doesn't really work. Picks up a few pointers from a dusty old tomb. He's a mighty fast learner. Black tonic, I think that's for using skills. Yeah, it's kinda hard to avoid them. Uh, when you're aiming with we your bow. the distillery, right next to the arsenal. Tough part of town. One All sip right. of the spirits in that distillery, and the kid will feel like a new man. So this is like leveling up, and I kind of wonder what this is. Stray fragments. I wonder if those are the blue things I'm collecting, but I'm not really sure. So I go with health first. Health is always good. And the arsenals where the kid can pick the best tools. For yeah, the job. we can switch weapons here, but I think I'm actually gonna stick with my bow because it's really good to kill those turrets. And I think there are gonna be a few more. Also, keep forgetting that I have to aim with my mouse when I want to. Some of hit those squirts burning like crazy. In a oh, I don't like those there. things. I really don't like those enemies. I don't know why. They kind of look awesome. Thinking about it, they actually look like those uh, magnet fragments from the from 
the skill we just saw. Oh. Didn't see this one before. That one was Maud, the tutor. Once taught the kid good manners. He never used them though. Hey, kill. Destroy this. Kill. This wall looks suspicious. But there's nothing here. Very barred since the kid on his way. The bastion's real close now. So there's there's a part coming soon where you can actually fall down, but it it doesn't it actually looks right falling down, but you can still keep running. But I accidentally fell down, so I kinda wanna try to not fall this time. So I'm curious what the what's over there at the end. Oh wow, he hit hard. Uh probably should drink something. Oh there's another potion. Uh, get, let's get rid of those uh seconds first because I need some room for the next fight. And I love the music, I love this a uh, not Asian, this Oriental. Uh, style. All right, let's go. Kid takes a chunk of alloy. The smell of barley and spoiled blueberries fills the air. Scumbags. Kid maybe shouldn't have done what he just did. And he actually makes holes in the ground, so have to be careful with that. And let's get rid of those, cause they are annoying! Oh, careful. Rob's a scumbag of his last meal. Uh, the... Oh, it doesn't really do damage, so... Uh, at least not on this guy. And there we go! Level 2 and lots of... Whatever... Shards or something. Just be careful to not fall down here. So I'm wondering if there's something here now. Nope. So let's collect them real quick. Oh, 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 that's dangerous. I don't like bridges and he finds the core games. to the wharf district. Oh, this is actually the part I was he talking about. He steals the city's heart. Might as well. So you can actually kill a lot of those to collect. Experience points, but um, kid hasn't feel any better. Get a move on. Yeah, the place is starting to fall. Kind of want to survive rather than getting experience points. So See that just core kid took was the only thing making this particular rock stay afloat. Run through here and try not to fall. Kid just keeps running. The thing is, though, that that um. If you if you run if you want to run up this way, you actually can't press up and down. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, to walk in a straight line, it's always like running too much last, the sky upwards, so uh, you will eventually fall down. I hope that makes sense. Okay, I haven't. Whisked him where it needs so to go. Far. Does that change anything? We will see. Now the kids oh, see something stranger still. His mind races. Hmm, doesn't look like it made a difference, so I guess I could just have Did to Did anybody go. else survive? Oh well. Sure enough, he finds another. He finds me. We talk yeah. for Hello spell. you. There's a bit of the Bastion's power in that crest. Enough to point the way to the cores. All I tell him is to set that core is on the monument there. Then watch. I try to let the kid down gently. This is the bastion, all right. Except no one else showed up. And just like that, the bastion comes alive. Starts growing again. 
growing stronger. Kids gotta put its power to good use. Now the Bastion can send him even farther into the wild unknown. So I guess we have to collect those cores and expand our Bastion here. Kid ponders what to build. I'm gonna build the distillery so we can level up. Takes time to sample spirits from my personal supply. And uh, like, I don't know if I should get this here. Yeah, it actually is this little mon monster. Stray fragments. Well, you know what? Um, I'm just gonna get it. Catching I think he fears is like a mouthful of nails. I think you can actually change it. it. Yeah, you can uh, change it anytime, so not too bad. We can just find out what it is. And yeah, we can't activate the others yet. So we have to we go on first. What's out there waiting for him. And we will do this next time, though. Yeah, let me know what you think about this game. And if you want me to turn this into a full LP. And you definitely should get it. I love it so far. And I think it's gonna be awesome. So thanks for watching and see you guys next time.